Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am going to be doing the real versus fake comparison on the Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in collaboration with Nicole Guerrero. So if you guys are interested in seeing my comparison, then just keep on watching. So starting off with the packaging, I have the real one on the right and the fake one on the left. And as you guys can see, the real one is a little bit smaller than the fake one. And also the color on the real one is a little bit more of a baby pink as where the fake one is more of an orange. Now, when I turn it around, I just realized that this picture did come out a little bit blurry, but everything here as far as the font and the wording was pretty much the exact same. The only thing that I found it to be a noticeable difference was the serial number. On the real palette, the font is bigger and bold, and the fake one is not. Now, when I take the palettes out of the sleeves, you guys can see that the Anastasia Beverly Hills logo is not as bold and seems to be a little bit smaller on the real palette than the fake one. And then where it says Nicole Guerrero, if you guys pay close attention to the holographic effect, it does seem to be a little bit more of a pastel color on the real one as opposed to the fake one. And now when I turn it around, the font on the real palette is smaller than on the fake one. And just like I mentioned on the packaging, you guys can tell that there is a difference on the serial number. Now when I turn it to the side, you can tell that the real palette is a little bit thicker than the fake one. And then when I turn it one more time, again you guys can see that the fake palette is a little bit longer than the real one. Now when I open the palettes, you guys can see right away that there are some differences. But I'm going to start by showing you guys the top of the palettes. Right here where it says Anastasia Beverly Hills, on the real palette, the font seems to be a little bit darker and maybe slightly more bold than on the fake one. And now when I show you guys the actual highlighters, you can see that the highlighters on the real palette are definitely lighter than the fake one. So here is a close-up of the shades Kitty Cat and Forever Lit. And then Forever Young and a Glow Getter. And then the last two shades are Daydream and 143. So here are some swatches. On the top of each color, I have a fake swatch followed by a real one. And you guys can tell that there is obviously a difference in color, just like in the pans. I did notice that the formula and consistency of the real highlighters was very soft and buttery and the fake ones were slightly grainy they did have a lot more texture to them um, as far as pigmentation both of them are very pigmented and i did feel that the real highlighters were just a little bit more illuminating than the fake ones even though like i said both of them were very very pigmented all right guys so that is it for this comparison i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please be sure to give this video a big thumbs up subscribe if you guys want to see more real versus fake comparisons and let me know down below if you guys have any questions about my comparisons and i will see you guys in my next video